Hello and welcome to my workout review. My name is Teresa. I'm happy that you join um, this workout for today. Um, we will focus on our core. So the only thing or the only equipment you need is just a yoga mat. Um, and anything else we don't need because we just do exercises with our own body weight. Have fun and enjoy. Start on all fours. Place your hands under your shoulders and the knees under your hips. Now round your back and go into cow position. We do a little cat and cow. Your neck and your head are the extension of your spine. And keep going. Now lift one arm up and the leg off the other side. Pull your elbows and the knee into your center together and extend. Very good, keep going. All right, change the side. Lift one arm up and the leg up the other side. Hold this position and pull elbow and knee together in your center. Take your head and your neck always with you. Third one, release. Now stand on your toes and go back into the downward facing dog. Bring your heels to the floor and walk back and stand up. Now bring your arms over your head Go down and walk forward. Place your hands under your arms and walk back again. Stand up, bring your hands over your head and walk forward. Now try to bring your hands as much forward as you can and hold this position for a short moment. Stand up. And walk forward. For this you need a lot of tension in your core. Hold for a short moment and walk back again. And once more, walk forward. Hold this position, step forward and go into jumping jack. Step back into plank. Step forward and jumping jack. Come on. A few more. And jump. And plank position. And jump again. Very good. Keep going. Don't give up. Hold the blank now. Hold this position and step to your side. Step. 
hold the tension in your core and come back into child pose slowly come up and again stand on your toes and come into plank position now we do the military plank that means walk on your underarms and straight your arms again bend your elbows underarms and come up slowly come back into child pose Now, come to your side, lay down on your underarm, lift your hip up, hold the side plank. You can also modify this exercise, you just need to bend your leg. If you want to go a step wider you can lift your upper leg up now change the side lift your hips up you can modify again with your lower leg just let it bend on the mat or you can do it a little bit more challenging then lift your upper leg up hold this position very good and release come into plank underarm plank and slowly lay down on the mat straight your arms in front of you now lift your legs up as well and pull your elbows close to the body we are doing a little exercise for your lower back keep on going very good although here keep your hand and your neck always extended to your spine and release relax Slowly come up on your underarms again, plank position, military plank again, straight your arms and come down to your underarms. Remember always tension in your core, hold the plank with your straight arms and slowly come back to chest. Come to your side again. We do the side plank once more. Lift your hip up. If you want to make it a little bit more challenging, lift your upper leg up. Hold this position and slowly change the side. And lift your hip up and if you like you can also lift your upper leg up and hold this position you're doing very well and release come back to underarm plank slowly come back to the mat straight your arms in front of you again Lift your legs up and pull your elbows close to your body. Look down to the floor.
right a few more and once more release lay down slowly come back on the underarm plank and we do the military plank again hold the tension in your core good job and come back into child pose relax for a moment and again the side plank lay down on your underarm lift your hip up hold the side plank if you like you can lift your upper leg up or if you want to make it a little bit easier you can bend your lower leg and release change the side and lift up hold this position hold 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 come on and go back into underarm plank slowly come down to the mat straight your arms in front of you pull your elbows to your body lift your legs up good job and release relax for a short moment that was a tough training all right push yourself up we go into plank again now pull the knees to your side and then cross them in your center cross cross side side cross cross side side very good keep on going and cross cross side side very good keep on going good job and slowly come back to child pose and go back to all fours then come to your side again but not on your underarms now let your arms straight Bend your lower leg and lift up and down your upper leg. That's a nice exercise for the glute. And come back to center, relax a little bit with cat and cow. Stand on your toes again. Lift your knees up a little bit from the mat and hold this position. Don't touch the knees with the mat and change the side. And lift up and go down with your upper leg again. You should feel it in your glute and 
come back to all fours. Now plank position and again pull your knees in the direction of your head, side, side and cross, cross, cross in the middle and pull the knees to the side of your arms. Good one, come to your side again. Straight one leg and go up and down. Stand on your toes and lift your knees up from the floor. Hold this position and release. Change the side and bring your leg up and down. Very good. And come back into plank. Hold this position. And now pull your knees to your side and cross them in the middle of your body. Good one. Good. And do a little cat and cow again. Stand on your toes, lift your knees up again from the floor and hold this position. Knees are just a few centimeters off the ground and release, go back to child's pose. Now, lay down on your back. Lift your legs up 90 degrees and now we do a little side crunches. You can also let your feet on the ground so it's a little bit easier to make it a little bit more challenging. Lift your legs completely up from the ground and cross. Elbows and knees together in the center very good Now lift your head up until you stand kind of your shoulder blade tips. Place your hand next to your ears. Your legs are 90 degrees 
To make it easier, you can let them bend and tip on the mat or you can straight the legs. Your spine should stay in a neutral position. That means don't make a hyper extension with your spine and don't press the spine too much into the mat. It should be neutral. Hold this position. We activate our core. And release. Relax for a moment. And next round crisscross. You can decide if you want to leave your feet on the ground or you can lift your legs up. Very good. Continue. And stay in 90 degree with your legs and straight one leg. Or you can also leave your feet on the ground. It's up to you. Stand on your shoulder blade tips. And hold the core activation. Neutral position and release. You can drink a little bit, relax for a short moment. And lay down on your back again. Next round. We start with crisscross. Good job. And continue, keep on going. You can do it. And release. Now place your shoulder blade tips on the mat again. Stay in a neutral position with your spine. Tip to the ground. Don't forget to breathe. The apps are already burning a little bit, <laughs> but that's good. For a short moment, relax. And now place 
your feet again on the ground. And one last time, crisscross. And release. And now go on your shoulder blade tips and bring your legs to the mat. Stay in a neutral position. tension in the core. It's really important. And release. Here you can activate your core again for a short moment. So hold your position in the neutral position and now release and relax. Let's start the cool down. Bring your knees to one side, spread your arms, look back from your knees and just relax. Inhale and exhale. You can close your eyes as well if you like to. And change the diet. Spread your arms again. Look back from your knees. And just relax. Close your eyes if you like to. Follow your breathing. Come back to center. Give your spine a little massage. And roll up. You can straight one leg. The other leg is bent and go into spine twist your spine is long look back over your shoulder exhale try to go a little bit more into the twist into this rotation Spine. 
exhale try to go a little bit deeper into this rotation slowly come back roll back again on your spine and give your spine a little massage again it feels so good on the back a little massage for your pelvic and slowly roll up and stand up come to one side straight arm and stretch the sides Change the side. Slowly come back to center. Bend your knees. Inhale. Exhale. Stay here, stay low, relax, feel the stretch in the back side of your legs. And slowly roll up. Relax your shoulders. for participating i hope you had fun and we would be so grateful if you join us on youtube and see you next time have a good day and goodbye